This baby was born with a full head of brown hair, but five months on, everything changed. But before we start, please take a moment to give this video a like, subscribe to and hit the bell so you'll never miss these great stories. When little Bobby Carter was born with a full head of thick, dark hair, his looks astounded his parents. As the months passed, however, the infant's appearance continued to transform, and now he can't go anywhere without people staring at him. Rachel and Gareth Carter hailed from Merseyside in the north of England, and in 2017, the couple had one child, a boy named Frankie. With another on the way, at Rachel's 34-week ultrasound scan, however, the expectant mom got some news that she may not have prepared for. That's because on that occasion, medical professionals noticed something highly unusual about Rachel's unborn child. And although the mother-to-be didn't want to know the gender of her baby, staff let slip that she could be expecting a girl as a result. But the prediction of the baby's gender wasn't based on any conventional medical evidence. Instead, it was made because, judging by the ultrasound image, the child appeared to have hair, and a lot of it, too. Recalling that moment in a December 2017 interview with the Daily Mail, Rachel said, When we went for our gender scan, the nurses were sure I was having a girl because we could see that the baby had so much hair. They had never seen a scan photo like it before. When the Carters welcomed their second child in summer 2017, though, it turned out that their nurses were only right up to a point. That's because while the newborn did indeed boast an enormous shock of thick, dark hair, the baby was in fact a boy, and his parents would name him Bobby. And at the time of Bobby's birth, no one in the delivery room, including the medical staff, could believe what they were seeing. They were all passing him around. All the consultants were having a look at his hair. Rachel told Carter's News in December 2017, one of the consultants asked for a photo of him to keep because of his hair. From that moment on, little Bobby became quite the attraction in the hospital. He was like a celebrity, Rachel added to the Daily Mail. The doctors were calling people around to come and look, and everyone on the ward wanted to hold him. Time would only tell then whether Bobby would remain just as hairy as he grew up. Rachel and Gareth certainly expected their son's luscious locks to thin out a little as the months passed. They never did, though. On the contrary, in fact, the hair just grew longer and thicker. He hasn't lost a single strand, which is unusual, his proud mom told Carter's News. So, five months after his birth, Bobby was even more hirsute than before. His dark, cropped mane had disappeared, however, replaced by long, shiny locks that boasted an enviable red tint. And as Bobby's hair grew, so, arguably, did his celebrity. Regarding the frenzy that her son's stresses had sparked, Rachel told Catter's News, Bobby tends to generate quite a lot of attention with his hair. We can't really go anywhere without him getting stopped and people wanting to touch his hair and stroke his hair. And Rachel continued, a lot of people local to us know about him because of his hair. Everyone asks me to take his hat off and show them it. What's more, Bobby has made an impression beyond his local community. Indeed, even in the Carter's nearest big city, their child stands out from the crowd. Rachel revealed to Catter's News, he stopped traffic in Liverpool on one of the main roads. There was a car full of ladies who wanted to have a look at him, so I had to take him over to the car. And the women in question were so besotted with Bobby's tresses that they stopped paying attention to their surroundings. Rachel explained everyone was fussing over him. There was a massive queue of people waiting to get past the ladies while everyone made a fuss of Bobby's hair. Perhaps like other celebrities, though, Bobby's appearance requires a lot of upkeep. As his mom told the Daily Mail, I have to blow dry his hair, otherwise it stands on end, she added. People think he looks like Wolverine, referring to the famous X-Men character. Thankfully, though, Rachel's youngest son seems to enjoy being beautified. She would explain to Catter's News, Bobby doesn't really sleep unless he's got the sound of a hairdryer playing to him. He quite likes getting his hair blown. He's a little bit of a princess when it comes to having his hair done. Of course, Bobby was not the first baby to have been born with a full head of hair. And as it turns out, children coming out of the womb in this way is entirely natural. According to pediatrician Dr. Bud Zuckow, 
it all comes down to genetics and ethnicity. Rachel also believes that Bobby's tresses are a result of his genes. She told the Daily Mail, my eldest son, Frankie, was born with a lot of hair, but not as much as Bobby. My mom told me that I was born with a lot of hair too, but he gets his hair color from his dad. And to keep Bobby's fans updated about his progress, his mom and dad have set up an Instagram page. That way, people all over the world can enjoy looking at the youngster's hair. We decided to set up the page as a way to document him growing up, Rachel explained in her Daily Mail interview. However, despite his young age, Bobby had already experienced one of the downsides of fame. In short, he's now so popular that his mom has to hide him when they go shopping to avoid attention. The boy's star status does have its benefits as well, though. According to Rachel, she added, He was quite a timid baby, but now he is starting to come out of his shell because of all the attention he gets. <laughs>